plug it in. It's going to say, hey, I see you've plugged in a new device. And it's going to load in the appropriate drivers. You'll notice that this scanner build, whoa. <laughs> Moving that right must, along. That must, be, uh, that must be why we're not shipping Windows 98 Absolutely. Yet. <laughs> Absolutely. And the game award goes to, oh, man, I have to pay a microtransaction to unlock. That's so stupid that this has to, hold on, I got this, guys. Here we go. You know it's true. It's really stupid. It's the exception rather than the rule. And I'm also happy to very publicly point out that NVIDIA has been one of the worst trouble spots we've had with hardware manufacturers. And that is really sad because NVIDIA tries to sell chips, a lot of chips into the Android market. And NVIDIA has been the single worst company we've ever dealt with. So NVIDIA, fuck you. <laughs> I'm Bill Gates, Chairman of Microsoft. In this video, you're going to see the future, Windows. Microsoft first came up with the Windows concept back in 1983. And today, the leading software users have switched into the Windows environment. It's really incredible how quickly our powerful applications like Word and Excel and PowerPoint have been adopted. It's not just Microsoft applications. Even companies like WordPerfect and Lotus have now come out with Windows applications. And every week, we see new innovative work, really attracting all the innovation in the industry. We predicted this a long time ago. And now it's, it's the future. Let's take a look. for you. I love this company. Yes! <laughs> developers, developers, developers, developers, developers, developers, developers, developers, developers, developers, developers, developers, developers, developers. Yes! You've discovered a bunch of virtual machines, and we can go look at what all those virtual machines and what they are. Maybe. You know, I always love it when, when demos break. Yeah, I know, I'm, I know, I know, I know, I forgot. 
So why are we talking here? I'm going to go install Chrome. <laughs> <laughs> What's that? I did slide it when I said it. It's not turning on. <laughs> okay. We'll let an expert see if we can turn it on. Mr. Zuckerberg, would you be comfortable sharing with us the name of the hotel you stayed in last night? Um, <laughs> uh, no. If you've messaged anybody this week, would you share with us the names of the people you've messaged? Uh, Senator, no, I would probably not choose to do that publicly here. I think that may be what this is all about. Let's plug it in. It's going to say, hey, I see you've plugged in a new device. And it's going to load in the appropriate drivers. You'll notice that this scanner build glows. Instead of Must be why we're not shipping Windows 98. Absolutely, yet. <laughs> absolutely. And the game award goes. To, oh man, I have to pay a microtransaction to unlock. That's so stupid that this has to. Hold on, I got this, guys. Here we go. It's the exception rather than the rule. And I'm also happy to very publicly point out that NVIDIA has been one of the worst trouble spots we've had with hardware manufacturers. And that is really sad because NVIDIA tries to sell chips, a lot of chips, into the Android market. And NVIDIA has been the single worst company we've ever dealt with. So NVIDIA, fuck you. <laughs> I'm Bill Gates, Chairman of Microsoft. In this video, you're going to see the future, Windows. Microsoft first came up with the Windows concept back in 1983. And today, the leading software users have switched into the Windows environment. It's really incredible how quickly our powerful applications like Word and Excel and PowerPoint have been adopted. It's not just Microsoft applications. Even companies like WordPerfect and Lotus have now come out with Windows applications. And every week, we see new innovative work, really attracting all the innovation in the industry. We predicted this a long time ago. And now it's, it's the future. Let's take a look.
you've discovered a bunch of virtual machines and we can go look at what all those virtual machines and what they are. Maybe. You know, I always love it when, when demos break. Yeah, I know, I'm, I know, I know, I know, I forgot. So why are we talking here? I'm gonna go install Chrome. <laughs> <laughs> I did slide it myself. Not turn on. Okay. We'll let an expert see if we can turn it off. Mr. Zuckerberg, would you be comfortable sharing with us the name of the hotel you stayed in last night? Um. If you've messaged anybody this week, would you share with us the names of the people you've messaged? Uh, Senator, no, I would probably not choose to do that publicly here. I think that may be what this is all about. Hello, everyone. Um, I hope uh, you like my new uh, Twitch intro. So I just checked for everything and yeah, I'm alive right now. Welcome all again, I mean. Um, I hope you liked my new uh, Twitch intro as I said. Yeah, unusual intro, exactly. I tried to create something uh, creative for the programmers and the uh, uh for the uh, other stuff about uh computer history and uh, uh programming history and i hope you like it i mean uh i was thinking the most funny thing i have ever seen in tesla pick up windows break skin yeah probably but um since uh it's not exactly the computer about or about programming and uh that's why i wouldn't uh Try to put it in my intro, honestly. So, how is everything? I mean, I hope uh, everyone is good right now. And yeah, Sahil, welcome. Or in the chat, uh, Major, thanks for the follow. Welcome to stream, by the way, programmer and snurry and yeah and uh hi peterol welcome hope you are everything is great hope you're healthy from these uh corona times hope you are safe or hope you are uh doing as much as uh you can for the coronavirus also So, how is the music, by the way? Is this... yeah. Is, is it... it seems... Uh, okay, so far. I'm not dropping any frames. The uh, stream quality seems uh, enough, at least. So, okay. Let's start uh, for the first clash of the night. I just um, uh, copy the link and... Um, updated my command so you can type exclamation mark link to the chat to get the current link I mean, this intro is really, uh, I really liked, by the way, when I found uh, all the videos and the other things also. And uh, I really like it, by the way. Hope you enjoy it as well. Uh, it will probably are the uh, Twitch intro uh, for the rest of the uh, 
for a long time um, probably i will uh, edit it with a different kind of categories uh, with a different diff with a different kind of videos maybe who knows hope you like it by the way okay mega welcome Hope you're in the chat by the way, I mean, I don't know if you are not, if you are or not, hope you're in the chat. You should have a randomized video back, uh, maybe, I mean, I mean, I really like it, uh, so it won't be uh, too much different for the other. I mean, I try to create some uh, uh, some programming computer related. Uh, so it seems okay, and I I really enjoy it uh, when I watch it also. For the for the first clash of the night, we have three player, no four player. I am Tell. Welcome. That is nice. So let's launch the clash. Let's not wait people for full five minutes. The reverse mods. That was a weird problem. Oh, you hate reverse. <laughs> um, You either find it obvious or impossible, exactly. Maybe somehow not impossible, not uh, impossible, but it is really sometimes not obviously seen in the test cases. I mean, who knows? This seems some kind of tricky, I mean... Thank you. 
How is this minus 30,000? I mean, it is 10,000, all of their square. question was quite weird, I mean... talk more i would like to know what you think i mean i can't think this one's probably i mean it's uh it's quite for me at least it's quite um different i mean the first thing i that comes to my mind is the square some of the squares something like that but uh, yeah, this is minus 19 is quite weird as case as ex as an expected output here and this should be some of the squares of the old input and and some of them and minus multiple what minus one but that's not a rule of anything that's weird i mean um what we gonna do here? What we gonna do? That is so weird. ASCII? I mean, I don't know. Probably not. I mean, these are all the different characters. It shouldn't be exactly something like that. I think some kind of numeric calculations. Yeah, I mean, that's so weird, honestly. This might be the tricky test case to, th to think something like you have to calculate some of their squares, maybe. Might be the tricky. Really, I'm not, I'm really not sure how to solve this one. Uh, since I mean none of the people will join the couldn't solve this one so far, so I suppose this has some problems with the question itself. Maybe it is too hard, maybe not. Who knows? But this is not exactly what uh, people expect uh, from at least the uh, reverse mode. Who is this? HT Progress. Oh, he will, will, he joined our streams at, at the past, if I remember correctly.
Hmm. That is so weird. I mean, maybe I don't see something obvious, or there is nothing to see as an obvious. Why this problem is even approved? Who is the approvers? Feels level 13. I don't know him. The others, aka say level 18. And Siren has to develop level 14. Um, I don't even know, honestly. I mean, maybe they saw what we can saw right now. Yeah, I have no idea, honestly. Sunan yok bu akşam şey uh, algoritmanikil belki belki on buçuk gibi açarım ya bilmiyorum on on buçuk gibi bu yayından sonra belki bir turnuva yaparız. Şimdi biraz böyle algoritma programlama yayın oluyor. Aynen evet yazılımcıyım. I mean that is such a weird question. Um, Anpas83, thanks for the follow, welcome to stream. Art code solution provided by example. I'm going to create this problem one star in all fields. <laughs> yeah. Super Tuna, bizim YouTube kanalımız var. İstersen orayı ta takip edersin. Böyle algoritma soruları falan çözüyoruz. Anadolu sesinden olur tabii. Niye olmasın? Öyle şundan olur mu, bundan olur mu diyor yok ya Tuna. Ne kadar kendini geliştirirsen o kadar iyi yani. For example, if b is minus four, we should write out. But if I are, if I hard coded, and validation will uh, couldn't be passed by the coding game by uh, probably. Zaman bak bizim YouTube'da veya aynı YouTube'da şeylerimizi de izleyebilirsin. Eğitimlerimizi eğitimler yapmıştık mesela orada onları da izleyebilirsin. Her şeyi ben YouTube'a atıyorum. Buradan da gönderiyorum. Twitch'ten de gönderiyorum mesela yayınları. Tekrar izlemek istersen falan. Hepsini atıyorum oraya. I mean... I'm such a... How is this possible with this question? I mean, I can't even think any anything. I mean, is this a problem with me? Not just problem with me. I mean, none of the people joiners.
That sucks. Okay. I mean, I suggest you do also uh, provide something like that. So let's back to home. Let's start a private clash. Let's start a new one. I just copy the link and um, updated my comment so you can type exclamation mark link to the chat to get the current link. Bunahan ünlem bir ay yazarsan komandı vardı onun galiba. Ünlem bir ay yazarsan gelir. Stack Overflow, welcome. Luwood, welcome. First time to see you, I think. Maybe, maybe not. I'm not sure, honestly. Cyrus, welcome. Rohit, welcome. Okay, last. Let's not wait too much, people. So we only wait uh, two minutes so far, and let's launch the clash. On Valentine Day, John's girlfriend gives him a bunch of tickets for this thing movies at different times his job is to watch the whole movies by those tickets alone and, uh, and then spoils her the story of each movie you will be given the start and end time of each movie output the maximum number of movies he can watch entirely not john can only watch one movie at a time and john have to watch the movie completely for it to count example three to five four to nine and five to eight the output is two because John watch John can only watch all movies three and uh, five and five and eight. Hmm. Umbra Torks, welcome. As you can see, you have now my in my VIP list. Congratulations, have a pink diamond. Oh, maybe, um, maybe I just, um, you are welcome, you are welcome. Maybe I just need to find the, um, Can I find the maximum number of movies here? In somehow I need to know the maximum number of how can I uh, something like maybe DFS using something like DFS or DFS I mean um,
How can I know this one? If I... No, that's not the case. The problem is that probably in this case, the, the, uh, the John have to watch the movie completely as a sound. Oh, Sahid already sold this one. Oh, you can go greedy if you know what to maximize and minimize. Hmm. I'm not good at calculating greedy algorithms. For the greedy approach, keep picking the movie that ends earliest. Did I really get this one? Top look good. Not sold this one. Keep picking the movie that ends earliest. So this should be earliest here. So which one? This one. But it's important that I can only between the boundaries here. For example, um, I 
I should choose this. Choose the. Um, which uh, which one I should? So you have to. Uh, Yeah, maybe, maybe that's not, uh, I'm thinking, overthinking somehow. Um, Yeah, I'm just maybe fully even figured out how can I perfectly um, implement this greedy uh, algorithm here. So, for example, even if I choose the, always choose the, uh, the movie that ends the earliest. Uh, I should check them. There is uh, between uh, between the movie itself, and uh, you have to uh, you have to be sh you should sure that you, there is only one movie that can be watched at that time uh, duration. Uh, mathematics, quantum, string. Thanks for follow. Welcome to stream. Yeah, maybe that's why I'm really getting uh, wrong in that case. It's because I, I don't know exactly how to implement with this grid algorithm here. I mean, I can't solve this one probably.
Hello, Ayetes. Yeah, I also stream in Turkish also. But as for example, I try to stream in English, but if someone writes uh, in Turkish in the chat, I will uh, respond him or her uh, in Turkish also. But the, I should keep the stream uh, in English as much as I can. Ambrotor's 50% sold oh, this one, that's nice. Yeah, I mean, I couldn't even solve this one. Probably even the one hour, because time is not the case for me here. I couldn't get the properly implement to the things that uh, in my head. I can submit it. I mean, it's only 10 seconds left. The question is, it's a fun, I think. Difficulty is maybe perfect since I don't know how to implement a greedy solution here. Statements and test case relevancy are ideal. Let's all people wait for the completed clash. So let's check his code here <clears throat> the input is here t is the array for e in range you get the time itself and t is plus equal time oh there's a oh you have to sort to Uh, you have to uh, you did already sort this one the, uh, the as you said in the chat get the only the uh, not only uh, keep picking the movie that ends ends the earliest I am sorting on the basis of ending time then watching the movie that ends first and then removing the remaining movies that start after it has ended Uh, removing the remaining movies that starts after it has ended. What's T here? T is the here. You can get pop. T is T plus plus and movie one. What? Why did you get the second movie here? This this should be this should be end, end time. I mean, what is the time here when you map using map? It's a it's a mapping. It's some kind of hash map or something. Let's start before it has ended. What you say? The removing uh, T is an array of starts and for all movies. Okay, 
But you say done, remove the remaining movies that start after it has ended. Oh, now I understand. Oh, okay, you... You delete all the remaining movies that start after it has ended. Oh, that's the, that's the key point, I think, here. So, um... You... So, what are you doing exactly? Here's something like starts and one, starts and two, okay. You, while you're iterating like that, you... Oops. Sorry about that. Um, so, you are removing the rest of the uh, movies that start after the first uh, movie ends. So, while you exit here, I mean... How can I uh, break this while loop here when you break it? And movie 1, t is e for e in t if e0 is bigger equal and. So, um, while T, oh, there is a, oh, you have to delete all the movies that, that should count as a T, uh, I pop the first movie, watch it, then remove all the movies that have already started before this movie has end. Oh, now I see. You are uh, uh, continue to pop operation while there is no movie, right? Oh, that seems logical, yeah. They will eventually, will eventually became empty by watching all movies or the movies getting removed due to being invalid. Oh yeah, you're right. You're right, Sai. That's a very nice solution. Yeah, that's nice. So oh, that's a, thanks for that. And let's jump back to home. Let's start a private glitch. Let's start a new one. I just copied the link and uh, updated my command. So you can type exclamation mark link to the chat to get the current link. Yeah, I like the question itself. I like the how you think and and yeah, implementation of it should be easy if you think clearly something like solutions. Okay, Sahil. Have a good luck with your exam. Good night.
存存存存存Okay, we are now six players. Let's launch the clash. Are you welcome? Nope, I didn't click it. Yes, I did. A prime is said to be weak if it is smaller than the average of the two surrounding primes. For example, 13 is a weak prime since it is less than an less than an average of the two surrounding primes 11 and 17 prime is still balanced if the average is the power of two surrounding primes it is equal this at equal distance from previous prime and the next prime okay otherwise the prime is known as strong Check if it is weak, balanced, or strong. Um, maybe I should check some kind of prime numbers here. Uh, pa -pa -pa -pa maybe I just need to write my full is prime. And constraints are enough for the integer okay if um and less than two turn false if and it's two two three four four each three is equal to two e less than and e plus plus and um if and mod e equal to zero i that means i can return false otherwise i should return so, so this is my uh is prime function here so i shall need to write the uh bar less smaller is and minus one and wash bigger is n plus one so um, while um prime smaller not prime and uh smaller minus minus and i should do the same thing for the bigger one plus plus and after we continue this file loop if and um and is equal um smaller plus bigger divided by two that means I should write else else if and it's smaller than the average Which is I should use um, floating point division here. Cross all up right and weak. Otherwise, I should 
fight. Uh, strong. Yeah, this should work. Let's play all these cases. Oops. Process is timeout. Is my is prime function wrong? It's true. Oh, it's not one. It's I. Oh my goodness. Let's play all these cases again. That is perfect. Oh, I can submit it. There's a fun question. Difficulties for fake statements and test cases of Levins are ideal. That's nice. Neto already solved this one in JavaScript. Kayu solved this one Ruby also. Mega 80, um, 85%. Maybe we can check it after the after the clash ends. I mean, maybe it just missed the uh, missed the simple uh, test cases probably. Yeah, maybe there's a problem with this uh, divided by two. Is these, if these are the pro prob probably are um, but wait a second, does your uh, this prime function returns uh, false for two? Since you write is less than uh one here for example two um can be divisible by two here for example oh, what is the two here root of plus one yeah maybe maybe this was the case here for two or maybe this one uh using not using a uh, floating point division maybe yeah that might be the case actually Okay, we are now six minutes left and two people still clashing, Matrizas and Rohit still clashing. Oh prime require prime, that's nice. Yeah, e dot prime. I mean, such a nice built-in functionality for Ruby. Yeah, Alice. Alice always says, I mean, Ruby is the probably the most uh, programmer-friendly uh, programming language so far. I mean, uh, it is really easy to uh, implement for all 
for most of the uh, possible uh, uh, functionalities I mean there are really a lot of there is even that odd that even uh, he will check for a lot of things I mean What do you think by the way? I mean you can write in the chat also with Ruby. I mean, did you use it? Did you like use it? Did you never use it? I mean it's such a such a programmer friendly language. There are a lot of built-in ways. For example, if I remember correctly, Alice said uh, there's almost uh, 150 built-in uh, functions for numeric values for exactly example as Caillou used here uh, dot prime dot old dot even Dios, hello, how are you? Metal sold in JavaScript is prime. We did the same probably use here, yeah. The code from Mega is okay, but the loop range uh, may time out for big N invalidation. Oh, you're right, yeah, that might be the case, Kayu. Yeah, you're right, maybe it has passed all the code test cases in the question itself, but uh, not passed the uh, validation. Uh, things yeah you might get a point actually okay there's only two minutes left right now Matrizas and uh, Rohit still clashing. Maybe for Rohit, since he uses C most of the test, most of the languages, it will be hard to write. And he just completed. That's nice. One hundred percent. Nice is prime function. Previous ones, previous prime, next prime. Yeah, that's nice. And matrizas you can try to solve in C sharp also. I mean, 
You can check my code also uh, since you write it C sharp. It will be at least I think understandable for you. That's nice. Okay, let's back to home and let's start a private clash. Let's start a new one. I just copy the link and um yeah, updated my command so you can type exclamation mark link to the chat to get the current link. Okay, we have now eight players that's nice nine players right now net also joined Okay, let's not wait too much for people. It's almost past two minutes, so let's launch the clash. Another reverse mod here. Wait a second, I sold this one in the past, if I remember correctly. Yeah, I sold this one in the past. And uh, select and um, array and um, this. Level test cases. Whoa, a lot of players already sold this one. That's nice. Oh, some doesn't really care. I should do. Okay, let's play all these games again. That is perfect, so I can submit it. That's nice, I mean, 
it's somehow maybe for the uh, some people it, it, it might not be perfectly see the solution itself but it is quite uh, if you look at little bit carefully you will totally get the idea it is fun difficulty is uh, kind of easy i think and cascade with limits are ideal Steel's Neto, Kayu, Mega, <clears throat> Umbra Torx. Already sold this one. Only three people left. Let's say it means more than. Also sold this one. That's nice. Matuza sold this one is a hundred percent. That's nice. Only Rohit. We are waiting for you. Since you are uh, using C, it might not be easy for you, maybe. here oh, you can just easily create a sum variable and calculate it exactly it's nice Please first, I want quite hard for me to extract numbers from the string. Oh, okay. You can submit it then. I mean, oh, you already submitted. Okay. Or the C, I mean, uh, you just probably understand um, the, uh, the question was is about uh, some of the odd numbers minus some of the even numbers. Pro you probably uh, uh, understand the question itself, but as I said, it's some kind of hard mine might be hard to implement in C. Okay, that's nice. Let's back to home. Let's start a private clash. Let's start a new one. And I just uh, copied the link and um, updated my command so you can type exclamation mark link to the chat to get the current link.
Lil Coder, welcome. First time to see you, I think, maybe. We are now 10 players, that's nice. I would invite him out, but he is usually so busy. Okay, um, Samza already also joins. That's nice. We are now 11 players. That's nice. Let's launch the clash. Another reverse mod. Hmm. I mean, this kind of questions, I think it's only just for fun, right? Oops. Oh, we don't need this one. These are... And I don't need even this one. Looks like also... Oh, there is a ch oh that I should oh huh I should find the chin blank and call claim the uh huh um okay. Maybe new string here. How many times I have to put white space here? Um, this is five minus in length is divided by two. I think that's the case here. Plus chain. Plus this one. Yeah, this should work, I think. 
this will in this case is oh I don't need I don't need the rest of the chain here maybe we should use like that that is perfect so I can submit it the chin got me. <laughs> yeah, exactly. It's always better to do for all the test cases. I think it's fun. I mean, the question is still quite too easy. Maybe test case are ideal. When I don't do all the test cases, I want 100% one for two, yeah. Fund. Thanks for follow. Welcome to stream. Okay, Caio, Seals, Blue Wood, myself, Mega. Already sold this one. And Ambro, Ambro Torx and Netto, probably as they say. It. There is a chim problem. Can you say something German? Um, um, Guten Morgen and Ich liebe dich and Guten Tag and that's all. I think. Is this all? Yeah, it's this all probably. Nine, yeah. I mean, <laughs> yeah, nine. Yeah. And I'm not sure I don't know any other words in German. Do I know? Maybe. I mean, I I like to listen to Rammstein a lot. Um, but as a sentence or as a word, I mean... Um, yeah, I probably don't know. I mean, there's a uh, there are a few words that I can pick in the Deutschland clip of Rammstein. For example, they say Deutschland, Deutschland, über allen, über allen, which means all beyond the uh, Deutschland, I think. We have only six minutes left, and uh, Rohit also sold this one 100%. There's only four people left still clashing. I mean, I really like this kind of questions. Maybe some of the questions, like um, something like, and uh, some of them maybe. You just need to print some muffin uh, 
uh, something like that. Some kind of uh, fun and uh, quite interesting questions, I think. Uh, Shal, thanks for follow. Shalef, Shalef, I think. Pronunciation. Thanks for follow. Welcome to stream. Hoş geldin selamlar. Okay, Lil Kodur is a 50%. Maybe you also have some problem to print in Chin. It might be, I mean. Chin is some kind of problem here. In which country do you do this business? What do you mean? I mean, uh, I'm from Turkey. Can get the chin working. <laughs> yeah, chin is some kind of problem. How many minutes we left? We have three minutes and three people are still clashing. Samza, Kroko and Matrizas. Uh, Şelef burası coding game aslında. Burası uh, biraz kodlama ve programlama e, şeylerini, pratiklerini yapabileceğim bir yer. Sana bir soru soruluyor. Böyle Crash of Code adında bir yapısı var Coding Game'in. E, sana bir soru soruluyor ve herkes, e, o Clash'e katılan herkes aynı soruyu 15 dakikada çözmeye çalışıyor. İstediği herhangi bir programlama dilini kullanılarak. Bazı test case'leri var. Soruyu %100 geçmek istiyorsam yazdığın kodun bütün test case'lerini geçmesi gerekiyor. As Samza, 75%, maybe you also have some problem with Chin, probably, printing with Chin. Aynen Şalif kesinlikle güzel bir yer. Only one minute left and much results and Croco still clashing.
Yani şöyle bazı şeyler aslında lisans istiyor birçok şirket dışarıda. Ama bence illa zorunda bir şey değil yani. Kendini geliştirirsen, kendini kanıtlarsan niye olmasın? Okay, we have only 20 seconds left. By the way, if you um, give up for the question itself, I mean you can always uh, just submit it to uh, not waiting for the uh, other people also. Uh, we don't want to wait uh, for uh, all the players here unnecessary. Okay, the clash is complete and smart results in C sharp 50%. That's nice. Okay, maybe uh, Kroko is 75% also. And maybe you just need to have some trouble with uh, printing Chin. Um, yeah, let's back to home. Let's start a private clash. Let's start a new one. And I just copy the link and updated my command. So you can type exclamation mark link to the chat to get the current link. Jet has down fisting problems. Beckhorn, welcome. Yani şöyle belirli bir e, programlama dili bilmen gerekiyor tabii bu sarı soruları çözebilmek için. E, eğer o seviyede değilsen e, bizim mesela YouTube kanalında şeyler var, videolar var oraya da bakabilirsin. E, orada da eğitimler yaptık mesela C Sharp ile ilgili e, işte Go programlama dili ile ilgili veya işte programlamaya nasıl başlanır, Learn How to Code, Code Akademi'den eğitimler falan yaptık mesela oraya da bakabilirsin. Oh, we are now 12 players. That's nice. Aynen güzel olabilir yani. Bizim YouTube kanalında ünlem social yazarsan seç chat'e direkt gelir YouTube Twitter adresimiz. Okay, we are now 12 players. Let's launch the clash. A train is going along the track of a length of L feet and is coasting at a start speed of the S feet second. Train speed decreases by half every second. Example L is 10, S is 5, position, position of the train along. Zephyr is first second, 0 second, S is 5, position 0. Speed is half, uh, blah blah. Um, Wait a second, I didn't even understand this one.
As the speed decreases, the position is strange along with the truck to get close to the road, but not turn, therefore the output is itself will be false. For example, L is 40. Um, Wow, everybody saw this one. I don't even understand this one. Just a second. And track of the length. Okay. Add speed. Oh, okay, I think I understand this one. Um, is this one question is about? That is perfect, so I can submit it. Oh, first of all, I was thinking that it's quite hard, but... The lower is very unfair. What is the lower here? Oh! Oh, yeah. <laughs> As a boolean expression, uh, as a string representation of a boolean expression. It is fun. I think the, the easy statement and test case to live in CR are ideal. Ikayu, Neto, Seos, Lubut, Mega already solved this one. Zermonit, uh, thanks for the follow. Welcome to stream. It's a very tricky question. I mean, actually, it's not tricky, but uh, somehow, if you understand uh, correctly the question and uh, increase it only half of it, and you will get some uh, for an infinite loop. How much will you go exactly in total? Even if you see some of the, for example, like, um, for example, like geometry or uh, using some formula in math, you can easily understand this one. To do some string like reaches stuck, yeah. Okay, Croco, Bacorn. Bacorn is uh, 8%, maybe only with some of the one cases. Okay, we will check it after the ended clash. I submitted true instead of true, yeah, probably that was a problem, that, that was a problem actually. But it doesn't fail for the, looks like we have the 100%, there's no case sensitive maybe, I don't know. Oh, 
Okay, Umbra Torx also sold this one. Only Matrizas and Hamza left. Blue Wood, you will. Um, yeah, you should just put, I mean, probably in Python, uh, not Python, in Ruby. This will uh, create some. The, when you put some Boolean expression, you will get true or false. I mean, you just need to maybe. Just, you don't need all of them. Just put S uh, bigger than L divided by 2. Ruby supports for that, probably. Bluewood, thanks for follow. Welcome to stream, by the way. Wine line gag, yeah, exactly. Okay, um, Matriza sold this one in C sharp also. Only Hamza we are waiting for. How many minutes we have? We have six minutes left. I mean, Bacon, uh, let's check Bacon's code. I mean, probably. Uh, hmm. Probably you don't even need to calculate this one like that. You just need to, for example, and plus um, and divided by 2 plus and divided by 4 plus and divided by 8. That goes to the infinite, which is equal to actually 2n. So you just need to check L is as other uh, L uh, some for example um, like where you did in Python here. Yeah, you just need to calculate is and compare actually. You just need to with S and two two times no two times S with L, which is uh, if it is uh, bigger than this one you should print true. If it is not you should print false actually.
I couldn't get mad in my first clash of the day. <laughs> oh, welcome. That's nice. Hey, Hamza, did you still clashing? By the way, I will still try to call this one. Or you can just submit uh, if you already give up or you don't understand it exactly you can check the people other people's um code also left right now Okay, Hamza, you just you can check the other people's uh, code also, or just still uh, continue the checking. I think it's not fair to wait uh, this much people here. Kalev, tabi teşekkür ederim. Görüşürüz. And uh, let's back to home. Let's start a private clash. Let's start a new one. I just. Uh, Copy the link and um, update my command so you can type exclamation mark link to the chat to get the current clash link. First time to see you, I think. That's nice. players let's launch the clash
complete the sum of the two diagonals of the spiral matrix of the size of k times k. The spiral matrix of is built in following way. Put one in the center and then put the consecutive number clockwise. Oh. Hmm. So what is the what is for three here, which is the seven plus of oh, the sum of the diagonals? Okay. In which the only the odd numbers maybe? Uh, I think that's not the case here. Because this seems like a coincidence maybe. And save him though. Thanks for follow. Welcome to stream. Maybe I just need to um, put a, uh, some kind of matrix here. Maybe just there's a formula to calculate like that. Starting with the
one maybe? Uh, no, that's not the case here. Oh, there's a wow, a lot of people already sold this one. Is there any formula like that? I mean, That's not the case here. I mean, for even numbers, or oh, maybe there, there is not possible to have an even numbers for that. For example, this one is always odd numbers. Yeah, it says k is odd in the constraints also. I didn't even read it. So is it always the some of the um, the square of the number there, I mean, or maybe something like um, um Oh. Uh, times plus one is by two, which is the power of this one. Is this one works? not the formula here i thought that the old odd numbers uh, that goes the, the square of the number itself but that's not the case here
Team King kann das kriegen. <lacht> um. Wieso Bot Diagonal Sun? Obviously, it's not the sum of the old, old numbers until it's square. But it it's, it's kind of makes sense, but not no, no, no, no, no, no. It's only get the diagonals, not odd numbers. For three, yes, all the odd numbers, but for the five, it's not. AK selamlar hoş geldin. Yeah, I mean... I have no idea, honestly. submit it I mean I have no idea how to solve this one but let's check the other people four and power of three three and power of two and eight and minus one divided by six Okay, I don't believe it by the way. I mean, not a lot of people uh, thinks actually know of this formula. I mean, you just check the Google, right? I mean, I mean, if you if you had this formula at the top of your head, I mean, I won't say anything, but looks like a lot of solutions should to could to ch uh, will be checked on the google i mean which which one uh, backhorn solution i think you googled one part i mean honestly for it i mean who me uh, memorized this kind of formula anyway if they are, I mean, I won't say anything, but uh, 
That sounds weird. That seems weird, honestly. Let's check back on score for range. Okay, divided by two plus one. Or in range four. Bacon, can you please understand what is the, uh, for example, uh, after this code uh, logic? Same thing. Okay, does anyone in the chat, does anyone solve this question? Can ex at least uh, explain? I collect, try to calculate each ring at a time. What, what is it for here? I mean, there is always four as a calculation. Most inner ring is just one, outer ring is three, five, seven, nine. But of course, this works for three test cases. Okay, Neto, I will check your solution also. Yeah, yeah I see, I see it. You, you draw the scroll of the paper, realize that the up corner is K square of K square, then every other corner is uh, minus K minus 1, so 4 times K square minus six times K plus one the one for one corner for two for other and three for other hmm Maybe it looks like, I mean, okay, that's nice. I mean, since there is no exactly formula, at least there is a formula, but, um, each ring's corners are n times n and times. That was my solution to each ring's corners are n times n plus n times n minus n minus 1 plus n times n You start n square and then you lower by n minus 
n minus 1 each time. How many times can I do this? And you lower that amount 3 times. It will be always 3. I mean... Okay, you start, for example, let's calculate it for 5. n square is 25 and you lower by n minus 1 which is 4 and um, then you do this for each ring. So I have to... What is the ring here? What, what, what is it calling ring here? It means that the diagonals... I don't understand the ring meaning here. What is the meaning of ring here? I mean... The diagonal is equal to each corner of every circle. I try to imagine in my head. For example, uh, in the example, there were two rings. X are ring flow. Example, K is 3, only have one ring. K is 5, has the one in the middle of and two rings around. Oh, okay, okay, okay, okay, okay, maybe let's check it like that in maybe explain it in the whiteboard also Okay Maybe it will be better to understand, okay, let's let's uh, let's uh, write it here as a uh, Oops Five times five So this one, this one, this one. Oh. And yeah, this is five times five, right? You say this one is a ring. Um, I just this one is a ring, and this one is another ring right oh the new lines in my message got deleted uh xa axis but e bigger than w instead of m will it make no sense trying to think how to explain yes these are the then the rings here 
but we have to calculate like some some this kind of diagonals right we have to calculate these ones so this is the nth, um this is for five this is 25 which is understandable and exactly and you have to sum up the corners of the rings and you got the corners of each ring right so this is the 21 which is difference between this and minus one which is four oh that maybe you have no no no no that's no actually this is oh that makes sense then maybe you have to for example with this square you have to go to uh one and uh increasing with n minus one all the time no not n minus one all the time for example for these ones you have to only um how many times there's oh there's a no, no, no that's not okay that's not right that's why you, oh you now i understand that's why you write four times here which is the four corner of every uh ring here you have to calculate um uh, oops where is the you have to calculate uh 25 21 and 17 and 13. So how you how can you pa uh, pass the smaller ring here what is the for example what is the first of the smaller ring here um one two three four five six seven eight nine oh then you still uh decrease it with uh n minus one oh three times okay Increase it three times, okay. But um, this one is also includes. 25 is also includes. What is nine? So oh, this is the um, this is the nine here, right? This is the nine, and um, seven, um, five. Three and one. Right. You start from the outer rings, then decrease the order of the rings. Outer is five square, and the inner is two square. Oh, the rings are separated by two. Actually, oh, actually. For example, for this one is also itself a ring, for example, for here, which, which is only one, contains one item. With only these ones, for example, this is the five uh, square, and this is the three square, and this is the one square, actually. Why I can't write here? One square. Hmm. Actually, you you start with the um, yeah one square exactly. I can write it here because at the edge of the core, edge of the uh, here maybe I should delete this one and um, I can write here what oops I can write here as a one square. You can write it like this one. So for the n square, um, first of all, I just need to uh, decrease starting from n square. I just need to decrease n minus one three times, and uh, after that, uh, I just need to calculate and n minus one square, which is the three square. No, n minus two which is all each rings increase it with what increase it by two so i just need to call do the same thing and uh n minus two square 
and I should go there after the uh, while uh, to reach one exactly. Oh, that's that's nice. I mean, that's a very nice calculation. Yeah. I probably never think like that. Yeah, I got it now. Now I understand it. I mean, thanks so much for all. I understand this. As Bacon as perfectly put it here also. Starting from one to divided by two plus one, which is three, for example, in here. Yeah. Get the square of it and plus sum of the s plus i. Yeah, that's nice. That is very nice, actually. Yeah, I mean, that's very nice. I mean, I really like the question itself. I mean, let me vote it. I mean, it's a fun question to solve, probably. Difficulties, perfect state. No, actually, awesome. Let's play awesome. Statements and test cases, Lewis, are ideal. Is there another streamer, by the way? No, we are the only one right now. That sucks. Um, maybe I just need to rates for the other people oh there's a and first of all i mean thank you so much mega seal speckhorn matrizas neto grief and death lulut umbratorx um bash uh thank you so much for joining me tonight let me let me write right um social accounts also in the chat you can see you can just check my twitter and youtube account also we are uh, I try to uh, create some uh, other programming related contents uh, on YouTube also. And let me check uh, our Discord channel as well in the chat also. And yeah, as I said, I mean, um, if you want to support my stream, I have a, a sub goal as you can see here. I mean, you can always subscribe my uh, channel as well if you want to support my stream. And let's read a girl called Foxilla. It is game development learning Python days. Maybe uh, we will read to him. And uh, a conscious C. Yeah, okay. Thank you so much. I mean, uh, if I uh, couldn't uh, uh, say anyone's name, I mean, thank you so much for joining me tonight. I mean, uh, you are really uh, great to solve together at least and there's a nine viewers right now let's rate uh foxilla i mean he looks like he is a uh, game developer and learning python he seems she seems cool and yeah thank you so much and uh, see you next time Ah, Sony Gono, thank you for it. Wait, it was a raid? Thank you for the raid. I also appreciate it. <gasps> and stack over blue. Wait, is it? Oh no, it's over low. Oof. 
Thank you for the follow. I really appreciate it. Thank you. Well, hello there, Conscious C. How you doing? And welcome y'all to my stream. I'm currently trying to figure out a mistake I made. But yeah. <laughs> welcome y'all. How y'all doing? In your current situation, I have my monster file, which represents monsters, and this 